everyone. Today's lesson is lesson 94, rounding to the nearest 10. So let's say I have set the number 17, and I want to know between which two tens is 17. So 17 is in between 10 and 20. Well, now I need to know which number it's closer to. Well, when I'm rounding a number, rounding to the nearest 10, I want to look at the one's place value. So all the numbers ending in five or above, we round up to the next number on the, on the line. So 17 is closer to 20 than it is to 10. So if I was to round this, I would round 17 up to 20. Okay. What if I have 43? Well, 43, I would, on my number line, I would see that this number is in between 40 and 50. But 43 is really close to the number 40. So I would round 43 to 40. Okay, because it's closer to 40 than it is to 50. All right. So what about 36? So on 36, on my number line, that is in between the numbers 30 and 40. Okay. Now I know the number right in between is 35. So 36 is more than 35. It goes right about here. So that means I would round this up to 40. Okay. All right, what about 24 and 58? So on my number line, 24 is in between 20 and 30. Well, right in the middle is 25. 24 is less than 25. It goes like right here. So that means I would round 24 down to 20. What about 58? Well, on my number line, 58 is in between 50 and 60. And right in the middle is 55. So 58 is more than 55. So I would round 58 up to 60. Okay. What if I had, what if I wanted to round the number five? Well, if I wanted to round the number five, it is smack dab in the middle of zero and 10. It's right here. Well, mathematicians have decided that when a number is halfway between the tens, we round it up to the next highest 10. So the five would round up to 10. Okay. If I had 15, I would round that up to 20. 55, I would round up to 60. So when a number ends in five or more, we round it to the next highest 10. Okay, and that's it for this lesson. Good luck on your homework.